And speaking of Chauncey Gardner, what impact or what do you feel he brings to the Detroit Lions defense when it comes to schematics and from an X's and O's standpoint? Is he strictly going to be a safety because you do have Kirby Joseph, somebody who I really loved a lot out of Illinois. You could move him to the slot. Like what impact what no, you role can. could he potentially have? Yeah, you can't move Kirby to the slot. You you know, this, you know, Gardner's gonna be the guy I think that's gonna move around. I wouldn't dare put Kirby in the slot. That, that, well, I meant I know. meant Chauncey. I meant Chauncey. Oh, okay, yeah, because you said you said put Kirby in the slot. No, nah, you, you put Kirby in the slot when you want to give up plays. Because in my opinion, you know, I watched I watch a tight end do him dirty. You know, I watch a tight end from the Bears do him dirty. That tight end ain't that fast. You'd have thought that tight end was was Pitts. It's not he's not Pitts. That's that's not that's not Ingram. You know what I mean? Like like no, nah, we're not gonna do that. So I feel like they're gonna use him as a, as a hybrid. This is a guy who's played linebacker. This is a guy I mean, in the league, in the league. He's played linebacker. He's played cornerback. He's played safety. And so I I, I, I suspect that they're gonna use him in that way. Put him everywhere. Put him at linebacker. Put him at safety. Send him on blitzes and stuff like that. Let him get involved in it. See, he he fits that mode of, of grit that they talk about. That gritty guy who's who wants to be involved. Yeah, do that. But no, no, he's gonna he's he's gonna be, I think, a rotational piece on certain packages where it'll be him and Tracy Walker and you know, whoever they decide at cornerback. You know, <laughs> we'll see, we'll pray about it. But I think, yeah, they're gonna use him all over, and that's how they should use him. You know, you want to give him opportunities and create space. But I would you know, I wouldn't dare put Kirby Joseph in a slot. That that's a setup for failure. That's that's like taking your ice cream out uh, uh, off off your uh, cone and walking into like a sauna. It's just gonna melt quickly. So no, I, you know, I think they're gonna move him around. I think they're gonna use him to confuse, uh, to set blitzes and to set you know different type of coverages. And I think that's that's a good thing. So again, it's a good signing. But can he stay healthy for all sixteen games? Now, what are I don't know how deep you've watched Chauncey Gardner, but from your early impressions of him, what are the two best traits that he has that are going to be useful into Detroit's defense? I know you touched on versatility, but what else? It's the reaction. His reaction to the to the ball is everything. And so to me, I love a player who has a, a great deal of reaction. He trusted his eyes a lot. And when you look at many of the interceptions that he got, it was just reaction. Oh, the ball was let loose. Boom. Let me react on it. You know, split second thoughts like, boom, oh, it's loose. And some of them were just reactions where it's like, oh, that ball popped up. Let me get that. He never stops tracking the ball with his eyes and reacting to the ball. And I feel like if the ball was somehow accidentally punted to the bathroom, he'll still pick it off because he'll, he'll react to where it's at. So to me, having that versatility, having that ability to react in that you know, regard to be quick with it. Those are the two traits that they love. That's what people look for. Those are the things that make me excited about adding him, right? Because it's that reaction, you know? And to me, you know, anybody who can have that great deal of reaction, that that's where it is that. So, um, you know, when you look at most cornerbacks in the league, the best of the best are able to react to the ball and do it in a split second. And, and so too often I see cornerbacks who attempt to play the receiver, and they do that wrong, and the ones who try to play the ball just want to look like they made an effort, but they was never really in position to make the play. And so he would change that with his ability to be able to, re to read and react and play in different spots to confuse the defense, I mean, the offenses that they're going to play.